Welcome back to Apex Alchemy. The beauty you see in front of you today is a Cherikov Scout. Before we proceed, hit that like button. Subscribe, tell your friends. Got some big giveaway stuff coming up, maybe, I don't know. <laughs> what are you laughing at? Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> No, for real, man. I just I've been watching the Glorious Bastards. <clears throat> He's grounded. So I'm 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 Lieutenant <laughs> Lieutenant Out of Rain. Out of Rain. <laughs> Bonjourno. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, listen. Uh, we got this knife in. Dave sent it in for our consideration. It, it's a Tropikov. Tropikov. It's it's a scout. <laughs> And you owe me scouts. <laughs> By watching this video, you take it on a debit of 100 scouts. And I want my scouts. You will get me my scouts. Or you will die trying. A debit or a debt? Sound good? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, man. Uh, this uh, this knife, we I really I really thought uh, like, like it, it would be a good one for Courtney. But the, the frame's pretty stiff for her. And... I think the detent may be too strong for her, but uh, like it, it, it performs fine. You know, like you can definitely tell that it's it's uh, built with great quality. Yeah, and I, I love the looks of it. Yeah, I think Dave uh, did this uh, Earl's Drench and Quench or something like that. Uh, that's probably not what it's called, um, but uh, it's some sort of Earl's finish, you know, it's, uh, some form of, of uh, anodization. Yeah, and I think I think he's the one that did it. I thought they come like that, but uh, I believe he's the one that did it. Uh, knife is like very lightweight. Yeah, and very thin profile. Let's see what the weight is. How about that? Four ounces. Four ounces for a. I bet for a nine inch knife yeah. with a one, two, or a one, two, three, four inch, four and a quarter inch uh, blade. blade, which is interesting. I mean, that, like to be a nine inch knife, it, it, yeah, it's titanium frame lock and uh, it, it meets all those demands of, of some of those people that want, want that ounce per inch on blade length. <clears throat> I very much enjoyed having it around. I carried it for a couple of days with the heater, and it's it fits in pocket great. Like it don't take up a lot of real estate whenever you whip it out. Like I didn't use it because it's not mine. Yeah, but like whenever you whip it out, <clears throat> it's a uh, it's enough. You know, you can like the way it fits in hand. You got some really good jimping. Yeah, it's small jimping. I, I, no, it, I, it I've really, really good. learned. I prefer that small jimping. I think like. It seems to provide more friction yeah. than the larger jimping. I like the millwork on this this knife. Like it reminds me of a stained glass window. You know what it reminds me of? Back when I was playing Skyrim back in the day and like getting the dwarven like communities or kingdoms or whatever, you know, and they would have all that like encoded walls and stuff. Yeah. That's what it kinda reminds me of. But man, I, I, I'm, I don't know. It's a, it's just a beautiful knife. I want to kind of introduce it, not to the collection per se. It, it may end up with this. I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll see. Like, uh, he don't want them back before Blade Show, so we got time to think about it. But um, it's a uh, M three ninety nine inches, four ounces. Like that I just jumping back here too. I realized on the backspacer. Yeah, I didn't even realize that. I didn't figure you did because you didn't mention. <laughs> well, I guess it'd be be okay for a reverse grip. Mm -hmm. Fits good in hand. It's like it's it, it's what is it like the like it's got this uh. It's like a full flat grind, or almost a complete full flat grind. 
it's like a I don't know. It's, it's very spider cubby blade when it comes to the to the, the shape. Yeah, and then <clears throat> I mean not the not the shape shape, but I don't know. I like the knife. It's uh yeah. It's pretty. I, I, I'm I really wish it was easier for me to open. We may be able to adjust some stuff. We'll see what we can do without like doing anything crazy. But we appreciate Dave sending it in, mm -hmm. and uh, I don't think I'm gonna make the video much longer than that. I'm not a I'm not a, a, a expert chair, on yeah, it. Yeah, <laughs> definitely not an expert on it. But it's 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 pretty nice. We've we've enjoyed having it around and checking it out. You got a piece of paper? We got some janky paper. Janky paper. That's the best kind of paper. Oh my god. Well, <laughs> come on now. You're doing so good. You're holding it at a weird angle, so. More than likely. Oh, I can't even see it. Yeah, carving away that janky paper. <laughs> we like some janky paper. Yeah. All right. Video. Oh, that, look at that. There is a. Oh, uh, that's card stop. Card stop. That is not too tough for the KGB knife. Uh oh, <laughs> look at that, look at that. Quit <laughs> saying that, or if I'm saying it, stop. Look at that. <laughs> What's not the light? What's not the light? Yeah, <clears throat> no, it, may be, it may need to be touched up a little bit, but I like it, man. I mean, what else does it say? M390, full titanium. And that's, that's it in my hand, like, it's uh, in case you ever wonder what nine inches look like in her hand. <laughs> I know I've always right, wondered. Buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Are you done? Yeah, I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, y'all have a good one. And we'll catch you on the flip side. Hey, we're going live. Uh, or are we going live tonight? I don't know. That was up in the air. It's up in the air. Okay, okay. Well, we'll figure it out by the time the heater video comes out. You'll know. Catch you on the flip side.